And lots of comments coming in during that break saying, when did you tell Sam? Have you seen him? And when or how did you tell him? Look, you and I are done. Um, I sent a text, like, not that night. I enjoyed mm -hmm. the next day at some point, I don't know. And I, I just said, you know... <laughs> I said quite a lot somewhere. of things. No, I just said, um, it's nice to see you've been making money off the back of it. Now you've got your own money, I don't have to pay for everything. Um, good luck with everything. Um, and I finally met someone who does really love me for being me. But I'm not, do you know what? Obviously, all the stuff in the papers I've seen, which I kind of I knew about already and I kept going back, but I'm not even angry because everything in life happens for a reason and it's led me to Jez. Mm. So, for it is one what minute, it is. you said you were going to marry him before you went in, and now the minute you come out, you're going to marry somebody else. No, I'm not, I'm not saying. I'm not saying. <laughs> you I'm did marry mention Jess. the marry one. I don't know, you, but from you, you did know, mention it when you came yeah. in. But that was because before I went in, obviously I got um, magazine stuff to do and all that, and I was put on the spot. And like I said, what from the past and stuff, and I've not really had that. I didn't know what to say, and I couldn't say I was going to hurt him. And he was like hinting, and I was like, yeah. And I, I couldn't not put him down. Yeah, so I think that was the problem there, Steph, because we didn't know that. Okay, yeah. I didn't know you, so I'm watching as a viewer. Is that if you'd have just come in and somebody said, oh yeah, she's got a boyfriend, but you were just like, oh, he's lovely, he's gorgeous, yeah, I love him, we're going to get married. So in my eyes, you had a very serious boyfriend. Yeah. <clears throat> so then when you started kind of messing around with with jazz, then I have to say I was thinking that's so wrong what she's doing. That's Do awful. You know, you know why else I did it as well? Because before I came. In, and Sam got Jez up on Twitter and was like, oh, he's going in. And I was like, oh. And then I was like, oh, God, this, like, what? And he was like, make sure you tell everyone that I'm, you know, the one you're going to marry, I'm going to be with you. Make sure you tell Scotty T, because, you know, like, you know, Scotty T and, and that lad, that straight away. So I was like, and I didn't want to do him wrong. I thought, and I was watching think... and I didn't say anything. I, I just, I just wasn't good, was Do you I? think as well you were trying to convince yourself that you were yes. happy and oh. that everything was good? Yeah, because I just, I've always... Being like a Bridget Jones, I've always just wanted to be loved. That's top and bottom of it. Well, me. can I, without wanting to sound like <coughs> your auntie Janet, <laughs> can I suggest you think of something boring <clears throat> like an engagement or a longer period before you say you're going to marry the next one? Yeah, 100%. <laughs> <laughs> what, what was it about Jeremy? What is it about Jeremy? Because it happened so quickly. Yeah. Um, what was it about him? His morals and everything, and you know, but his morals, he was snogging you. No, no, but I mean, time. the way, the way, the way he is, like, guy, I got speaking to Jez, and I don't know whether he got shown, but when he was younger, because um, I asked about the locket around his neck, he, he lost his mum, his brother and sister, all in the space of 15 months, and lost everyone. Wow. And the only picture we've got of his mum and brother was around his neck. That's why I got so upset when he gave me the necklace, because it was a big thing to give. And I just couldn't believe his, his mentality and the way he speaks about things and the way he's so... I uh, just he was down very to work and, and for calm, you, wasn't he? Yeah, Calmed and you down. just got a real great outlook on life after having such a terrible time. And he was so young, and I just I couldn't get over it. And then um, we started obviously falling for each other. And then I got up and sang Valerie, um, the Amy Winehouse song, and he looked at me and thought, "This is weird." And oh my god, I love you because his mum na his mum's name was Valerie, oh. so that was weird too. Where is the locket? Because you've been wearing no, it. No, I all have had it. I've just not got on today, but yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm seeing him later. So oh. yeah. Um, you're talking about Valerie. We've got a clip of you singing oh, because no. we knew you as an actress. I had no idea I've that you had this in amazing, the amazing voice. Amazing voice. Thank you. Something you would like to do? Yes. Yeah. Is, is music. No. Music's my everything. It has yeah. always been my, my number one priority. I've wrote two tracks, hopefully to to bring out like this year, which are yeah. really, really good. One of them's about boys as well, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. Really dull, yeah. And I have to ask you one thing which was in the papers, a lot of things are in the papers, but this is live, so you can clear things up. Okay. And um, there was a rumour that that Jeremy had cheated on you yeah. with somebody since he's come out of the house mm -hmm. and you were still in there. What would you like to say about that? Rubbish. Like okay. uh, the girl even cleared it up on Twitter. She was like, well, thanks for the shout out. I think and me and Jez knew that was gonna happen. People now and in some ways, just don't like to see people yeah, happy don't. and are going to try and, like and, and bring us down. down. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so... well, I've got one more little thing for you. Kay. Here's a message for you. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> hey, everyone at Loose Women, it's Jeremy here. I know Stephanie's on today. I just want to send her a quick message to say that I love you, I miss you, and I'm going to see you very soon. Say hi, yeah. Hi. Hi. Hi.
say one last thing. We were talking about um, Sam Reese, your, your boyfriend or ex-boyfriend, and he would like to say that the rumours, any rumours of him being unfaithful to you are completely untrue. We'll park that there. You've had your say. He's now had his say. Thank yeah. you, Sam, for getting in touch. Uh, we'll leave that there. Listen, we wish you well with everything that's ahead. Um, you know, we said we, we watched you change in the house, and I hope yeah. there's happiness for your head um, and, and for you and Jeremy. We hope it does work out. Stephanie Davis, Thank everybody. you so much for having me.